Hello. Welcome back to Brandish the Dark Revenant. So uh, last time we tried this boss and he's um, a little bit terrible. I, I'm actually just going to go ahead and switch to the Infinite Sword. I've, I've actually attempted him a couple times already. I'm going to take out a Life Ring. And my Barrier Ring. I keep getting killed to the action delay. Yep. I'll press a button and it just does nothing. Like many times I've sh I've shown. Oh, oh, now you do it. Now you want to do it. Sure. I've shown in the middle of combat. I will press the the uh, the analog stick and then the button to use magic, and he just stands there. Same thing happens with potions. It's worse with potions, because you'll still take damage and die. That's fun. Okay. I think the, think the strategy for this idiot is to kind of back him into a wall and just keep hitting him. Heal! Right there. He kept swinging his sword instead of using the potion. That got me killed last time. It's a ring. It's not like there's combos. I can He can stop in the middle of any action and use an item. And he just won't. And it's worse because he, when he gets low, he makes a clone. And they both do the same damage. Yeah, this is this is the strategy. Back him into a, a, a wall or an edge or whatever, and keep attacking him. No, go back. There you go. No. My guy, just stay there. I'm not gonna let you do anything else. Oops. That's not flashy, but I should get through him this way. Kind of wish I had healing magic already. I mentioned it before, it does work like the potions. It's it's uh, healing over time. So while I'm doing this, I could just be healing. No. Go. The clone acts the same, but has less health. Otherwise, he does just as much damage. Right there, I was mashing the button and he was staring at the guy. That's not how you win fights, Ares. Like, maybe that worked on Dale in the past. But these, these guys are far more annoying. Entirely possible I will run out of my ring by the time this fight is over. There's a clone. Huh, I remember him doing just as much damage. Stop swinging! 
Thank you. Wow. Like if the if the deaths were my fault, sure, but they, they none of them on this boss fight have been. If the game decides that swing the stupid sword, you. Ah. Uh. Not let them get behind you. Either of them. Thank you. Wow. Okay, let's not do that again, guy. Come on! This, this is bad. This is a bad fight in this version of the game. that swing. I didn't even press the button there. Okay. Is it obvious I'm getting annoyed with these stupid shadow clones? I have to heal to use barrier to heal. I can't outplay the guy. It's not a thing you do on this boss fight. Come on. I mean, what do you do? Finally, wow. Like half the video right there. He is nowhere near as bad in the original. I might as well just dispose of this. castings of barrier are still valuable and definitely save
And those pits are, uh, they drop you to the floor below. Which heals him. It resets the fight. Screw you, that's why. Again, nowhere near as bad on the original. I don't know who signed off on some of these changes, but you should be fired. Oh. Just invincible. Okay. Got one. Oh! Oh, that's an infinite use saber. That is not bad. And this infinite use rapier is actually worth a fair bit. Huh. This is not a thing in the original either. Is this the... No, this isn't the monolith. What is this? What is the point of this? Are you... Are you serious? <laughs> to get the monolith, I need teleport magic. <sighs> Okay, screw the cave. Wow. Now somehow there is a trick to get it. I I assume the same way or a similar way to the original. Because the uh, the floor that it's on, I can actually just bring up the map. Well, let's do them kind of slow. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. But the floor that it's on, yeah, it's. But there's a sound test room up here, and it, I, don't, I don't remember exactly where it's at. But out here somewhere. Is, uh, teleport magic. And it's obviously still on this version of the game because I only have 42.24% of this floor and I have gone literally everywhere. And somewhere in this corridor here, right in the middle, was the monolith, I think. Or maybe it was in this one. Anyways. Yeah. But, well, that's gonna be it for the cave, finally. I am a little bit concerned. I have not gotten the Demonic shield? And you can't do wheel weapons in this game. Well, I guess let's go. Beyond the caverns lay an expanse of dark, darkest blackness. One step into the void and all sense of direction was gone. The air was thick and oppressive and felt as though it might consume me. Here nothing was as it seemed. All bets were off. Still. I'd come too far to turn back. Dark Zone. Okay, they made this theme extra creepy. Um, 
Now we can use the demonic stuff. The demonic armor will no longer paralyze me. The, the sword didn't seem to do anything. Actually, I'm going to check something real quick. Keep the sword on and go to the next floor. I have status. What is... What, what kind of strength number value is that? I assume that's the experience. Okay, that's... That, mean, that tells me nothing. 102 attack. I didn't think to check this. 76. It seems like the swords don't do anything. I think the swords originally lowered your attack to zero or something like that. Or they just didn't add a, a value to it or something. And the armor, we've already seen it paralyzes you. The shield, I think, also lowered your armor. I think originally one of them was constantly draining your health. Or did the sword do that? Why do I not have full health? Because I didn't rest. Okay. Anyways, enough messing with that. And, uh, do not worry. The dark zone is not very long. It is two floors. Both floors are bad, though. The enemies will absolutely wreck you if you do not have the armor. Dark Zone. Herein, one may call upon the help of demons with impunity. That's yeah, telling you you can use the equipment. Seventy-five. Okay. Yeah, this is just a really good sword. Nope. Nope. Don't do that. Close the thing. There you go. I, one day, I will remember how to use the map. Not today. Also, there are pits on this floor. All over the place. So that's going to be fun. And if you're wondering what keeps the enemies out of this, from coming in and attacking me when I was sleeping there, nothing. Nothing stops them from doing that. Okay, that wasn't too much damage. I didn't. I did not actually know that was there. Uh, but you can also see, or or can't see. There is absolutely no indication that there's a pit there, at all. So these are not going to last long. And I do have a map. And the pits do not hurt too much. Also, the enemies will drop demonic swords better than 20 durability. He said I had a... Okay. Just to show how bad this was, they just immediately step into a pit. These are the only two pits next to this wall. I, I'm... I'm... I'm just good at video games, is, is what it is. I think these enemies are basically immune to magic as well. These will also float over the pits. There are, is another enemy down here. Those things that do not. Ow! killed it. I'm going to equip this. You can see how much we need that. Oh, great, the map isn't accurate. There's supposed to be two pits down here. 
All right. The bread can stay where it's at. This pit is supposed to be here. Okay. Okay, th that's not horrible. So if I don't get a bunch of... swords, my regular sword would at least do okay damage. What I would like to do is map the perimeter. Okay. So they just do a ton of damage in this version. They don't have crazy defense. You swing your sword. Not when his shield is up. Thank you. Immune to ice. Good. Hey, get back here. Jerk. All the... Nope, don't nope, stop. Although this game does not really have respawning enemies. This version, I should say. Nope. Okay, that was me leveling up. Alright. I saw something in the... Nope, nope. Don't. Ha. <sighs> Oh, good. A, a random greatsword. Nope. Close the menu. Huh. Okay, this is going to be a fun floor. Swing your sword, thank you. Oh good. These things respawn. I was concerned about experience this entire game, because enemies weren't respawning. But don't worry. These horrible enemies respawn. Uh, I'm gonna pop a save. Somewhere in this mess. That, I think. Okay. Okay. Somewhere in this mess is a door. Good, these can also defend. This, this is gonna get worse before it gets better. I don't think the iron ball is going to help me all that much. And I swear I'm supposed to get more swords. I think this would be better if I had the shield. I have no idea why I do not have the shield. You gonna, you gonna swing? There we go. Yeah, some of these enemies... Okay, I thought, for a second I thought you dropped something, but no, that was my broken sword. Some of these enemies are supposed to drop swords.
Come on. Take a swing. I guess if I'm patient with the melee enemies, it's not going to be too bad. Now this floor I can wholeheartedly, wholeheartedly endorse the use of the retry bread. Okay, that one's where it's supposed to be. It concerns me. The one damage concerns me. And I should not have backed up. I should I should not have let them all out. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. Nope. Back up. Yes. Yes, let's add magic. Come on. So I have to get into the rooms on all four corners. And there are... Which is like the one I hit in here. Okay, he can't shoot through this guy. But he doesn't immediately get his shield up after attacking, so that's fun. Yeah, if I had the de demonic shield, these, this would not be too bad. I would have a lot more defense. I have no idea why I do not. I think some of the equipment can also be found. Maybe not this floor, maybe the second. But I could also be thinking about the second game. They like their dark zones. They're, it's in, like, every brandish. Okay. Uh, I really should not have put them all out. Uh. Maybe we don't need to kill everything on every floor? Maybe? Really? Okay. I don't know why you were just standing there watching me sleep, but I'll take it. I found another hole. I was I was concerned I wasn't finding enough pits. certain that the enemies that were in these rooms do not respawn. But the rest of them probably do. Probably. This would be horrible without an infinite sword. I don't know why nothing is dropping anything. That that feels like a really dumb thing to change.
Well, I'll get through them eventually. Nope. Okay. <laughs> There's three of them out there. I didn't want to come out, but I had to. And I can't close the door. Well, those knights might legitimately one-shot me if I'm sleeping. The ones are nice for strength exper experience, but I would really like to kill these things. Oh good, you brought a friend. Come back, friend. You need to die, too. Compelling gameplay here. I've been needing int levels. aren't as defensive, so I'll just melee them. And I am aware I'm over time now. I really wanted to make more progress on this floor. Let's, uh, nap up to full. Okay. And the iron balls are not doing... Are, are you... Okay. The iron balls are not doing what I was hoping for. Why are you there? Whatever. Why did I do that? Okay, so we will hopefully get through this floor next time. Through all of the Dark Zone. I, I don't think the second floor is nearly as bad as this. This is one massive open floor with a lot of pits. And that, well, I say a lot, they're just random pits. Anyways, uh, we will do that next time. Hopefully finish off the entire Dark Zone. It's only two floors. Uh, but yeah, we will hopefully get through this next time, and yeah, that's going to be it for this part. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you stick around for more, and thanks for watching.